Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Ino. In today's video, we'll look at how to connect to a Linux Mint machine from a Mac device and we'll be using RDP or Remote Desktop Protocol. Now we'll need XRDP software on uh, Linux Mint. This is the software that enables uh, RDP connections to Linux Mint. We'll need to do this on the terminal. So I'm opening the terminal here. And let's run the first command for updating the system packages. The command is sudo apt update. Put in our password. Okay, that's done. Next command is for installing XRDP and the command is sudo apt install XRDP. So it's already installed on this machine. Now that we have it installed, we'll need to check uh, the services to make sure they're running. We can use system, system, CTL status, XRDP. And it's showing that it's active and running and it's enabled. If it wasn't, we can, these commands we can run to do that. Let's look at the commands here. Now the command to enable the services is a sudo system 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 ctl enable xrdp this enables xrdp and to start the services we'll use start xrdp so to stop the services just use stop xrdp so those are the commands for those actions once you verify that the services are running xrdp services are running the next thing you might want to do, depending on when whether you have a firewall enabled or not, you might need to open the port for XRDP, which is port 3389. The command to open the port is sudo ufw, ufw allow 3389dcp. So that's the command to open the port for XRDP. Finally, we'll need the IP address of this machine that we'll need to input on the remote desktop client on the Mac device in order to connect to this device. To find out the IP, there's two commands you can use. You can, use, you can either use IP address command, and here it gives us the IP address. So just take note, take note of that IP address. We'll need it later on on the Mac device. So the 172.16.1.103. The other command you can use is ifconfig. And that should also show you the IP address, which is similar to this. That should be all that we are doing on the Linux Mint device. The other steps are going to be on the Mac device. So let's go over to the Mac device and uh, finish the settings. So we are now on the Mac device and we'll need the remote desktop client on the Mac that we'll use to do a connection to the Linux Mint device. So we'll need to search for the app. We'll open the launchpad here. And let's search for the app store. So we have the app store open. We'll need to search for remote desktop client. Client, press enter. The one you want to use is this one right here, Microsoft Remote Desktop. So I already have it installed. If you don't have it installed, you'll need to get this one and install it. Once you have it installed, we'll go ahead and launch it. Let's go to the launch pad here again and search for Remote Desktop. It's right here, Microsoft Remote Desktop. So click it to open it. If it's your first time, you might not have any uh, PCs or connections added. I already have a, a two added here. Now to add a new one, you can click on this next to the plus sign. If you click on the down arrow, you'll see the option to add a PC. Click on that. Here you'll need the host name or the IP address. So we already got that IP, which was 172.16.1.103.
1.103 this is the IP for the Linux Mint device now one thing you might want to do before you try to connect is to verify that you can actually reach that device so you can open the terminal and try and ping it so we'll do ping 172.16.1.103 press enter and we're able to ping it so the control C to end the ping now we'll put in the IP here and under user account you want to add a user account for that particular device so add user account and here you can add the username and the password click add now you've added the username or the user account okay the other options we don't need a, a gateway here we'll leave the defaults for this and then we'll click add and there it is you can see the IP now if you click on this uh, option right here you have the connect option you can click connect and it's saying that the identity of the remote PC can't be verified do you want to continue anyway? I'll say connect, connect. And connection has been established. It looks like it's full screen. You can come over here and minimize it. Okay. And this is the Linux Mint machine. We've managed to connect to it using remote desktop. You can see the IP address is showing here. I can open the terminal and use W to show who I'm logged as, I can do who am I, saying that we are logged in as Eno. So that's it, that's how you can use remote desktop or RDP to connect to Linux Mint from a, a Mac device. I hope this information has been helpful, I'll catch you in my next video, thanks, bye.